Hi, so we're going to go through the 2016 PAT paper looking at question 5. So question 5 asks how many numbers greater than 5,000 can be formed using the digits 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and only those digits without repetition. Okay, well, let's notice that 5,000 has, only has 4 digits. So clearly any number with 5 digits is by definition going to be larger than it. So let's consider how many 5 digit numbers we can make. So let's consider we have the first digit, the second digit, third, fourth, and fifth. So how many choices do we have for the first digit? Well, we said that any number with five digits is going to be greater than the number with four digits. So we can actually pick any of these five. So that's five choices. So it was just right here. Choices. Number of choices. So we have five choices for the first. Well, we can't have any repetitions. So we only have four numbers left. So that gives us four choices. And similarly, we can only have... We can't repetitions again, so it's three choices, and then two choices, and then one choice. Okay, so that gives us a total of how many? So five times four times three times two times one. Now, we can also make a four-digit number. Four digits. So again, we consider the first, second, third, fourth, and fifth, and we'll have a number of choices column row. So how many do we have for the first? Well, if we pick a 3, we're going to have 3,000 and something, so that's going to be less than 5,000. If we pick a 4, we're going to have 4,000 and something. If we pick a 5, we can have something larger. So we can have a 5, or a 6, or a 7. So that's three choices. Okay, well now we can have actually any of these numbers for the second digit. However, you have to remember we've actually picked one of these already. We've picked one for the first. So we only have four numbers left. So that's four choices. And then for the third digit, we have three choices. Fourth, we have Two, and I don't know why I wrote a fifth column, so only a four digit number. So that gives us how many? Well, three times four times three times two. And therefore, the number is five times four times three times two plus three times four times three times two. Well, that's equal to four times three times two divide, uh, multiplied by, well, we have a five plus. The three. So that's 4 times 3 times 2, which is 12 times 2, which is 24, times 5 by 3, 5 plus 3, which is 8, and that gives us a total of 192 possible numbers.